Hey folks, this is Ted Cantu with Online Money Machine Show and also the end of Advertising.com. And today's question is, how can I beat high media costs? Got yeah, one word for you, podcasting. And what the heck is podcasting? Podcasting is a technology that exists on the web that allows you, either a doctor or a lawyer, really any profession, uh, to have your own online radio show. This is very important for a number of reasons. One, you're going to save a fortune on airtime fees. Airtime can be very, very expensive. If you're looking to um, get your own show, you got to get sponsors. you got to get people to support you. It, it, it's a headache. And I used to have a radio show in Detroit uh, years ago, and I had to get sponsors and pay for the airtime. It was horrible. I got very little response from the show. We had low wattage at the station, and the people who did call me were very, very lonely. I had like 10 people that called me you know, every week. I have uh, <laughs> some of them still call me, believe it or not. And I've been off the air for years, but that is a problem. And if you're um, in that situation, Look at podcasting because it's so it's so incredibly affordable. It's like like fifteen bucks a, a month, and you can have your own show coast to coast on the web. You want to put these radio episodes on your website so people can come to your site and find out what you're all about and see if they want to actually spend money with you, and that's really really important. So consider that. Uh, you can go to Podomatic.com. You can get software to uh, record on. It'll also distribute your show for you right there. You don't have to really worry about uh, too much detail there. There's Podcast Pickle. There was, a, I think, Podcast Factory was another one. There's, uh, there's some different services out there that are really, really good. And also, uh, there's a, another way you can distribute your radio show on iTunes. If you've never considered doing that before, that can get kind of interesting because you can reach some really great people and also educate the public about what you do. And this is all without spending any money on airtime. You don't have to spend any money at all on uh, commercials and uh, you know finding the right type of people to support your show. Because airtime can be very expensive, whether you're doing television or you're doing radio. Um, it is not cheap. So this is definitely a way around it. And I think instead of broadcasting, broadcasting is a way that you can talk to a lot of people. But what we're talking about here is narrowcasting. Narrow casting basically means that you're talking right to those people who want to buy your services. I mean, imagine this. This is advertising in reverse. That's why we call it the end of advertising. Instead of broadcasting, which is way, way, way wide, we're throwing a huge net over the uh, the public. Now uh, we're putting our marketing messages in the smart places on the web, and people who are interested type us in, and they find us directly. They come to us and we are perceived as experts that's the whole point of doing this and if you've got a book that you want to promote if you've got an ebook you want to promote that is something you want to really consider and i know a lot of doctors out there do have a lot of written material that they would like to put out into the public this is a great way to do that so that is my insight on podcasting uh it's fabulous and some services will actually give you a map of the US and you can see where your show was downloaded that's very very important you're gonna wanna see who's listening to your to your show and what parts of the world or the country that you're uh, that you're popular in and um, I remember one year uh, when this technology first came out I actually had a podcast show that was coast to coast and I looked on a map, I could figure out who was downloading my show, who was listening to it, who found me interesting, and my sales cor uh, actually correlated right to the actual states where my show was present that year. I could actually see clients coming in from Pittsburgh, uh, some came in from New York, some came in from Chicago, I had some from Toledo, it was kind of interesting. So that's what can happen for you, and I think it's pretty exciting. For more tips and uh, questions answered, uh, whatever you want to send, you can send that to tedcantu at gmail.com. You can give me a call, too, right here at 248-631-9211. I am Ted Cantu. I'm an ex-art director from Chicago, New York. I'm going to answer all your questions. Come to our site. We have a commission program that we'd like to see you be part of, and um, we can work together and make some profits. 
Until the next time, thanks for listening.